Hi guys! Phoenix Witch 666 and this is my second video. Um, I'm in little space right now, which is why I sound like this and why I have this bow in my hair. I like this. It makes me feel little. <laughs> um, I told you guys before my little age ranges from like 6 to 10 years old, depending on my mood. Whenever I'm like Whenever I'm having like a real, real bad day is whenever I go to like my younger ages and today I'm feeling kind of like, well right now I'm feeling kind of seven-ish, so yeah. Um, today didn't really start out very good. I actually got some sleep last night, yay me! But today didn't really start out very good because my, one of my ex-boyfriends got a whole got in contact with me and it wasn't good. Um, I don't know what to think there. So I just kind of brushed it off and went into Little Space to kind of avoid it. And I do smoke when I'm in Little Space too, so I'm gonna go ahead and get that done. It's gotta be more. <coughs> Being dry stinks. I thought I had more in that bowl. Sucks. Oh well. So I guess I guess I can kind of tell you guys what it's like in Little Space. Um, what Little Space means to those of you who don't know, um, it means that we retain part of our personality that is still childlike, and when we, some of us, we usually go into little space when we want to avoid, like, big people problems and drama and stuff like that. And I do it sometimes whenever I'm sad and I just need to feel a little bit happier. <laughs> Doesn't always help though, sometimes I just end up crying because I don't have daddy to hold me. It kind of sucks that he lives states away. No, it really sucks. <laughs> but that's life, I guess. But yeah, being little doesn't have anything to do with, like, incest or whatever. I don't know where people get that idea, because people are not related whatsoever. Um... It basically has to do with the border girl taking on a more childlike submissive role while the more dominant partner takes on the more nurturing and caring role, i.e. daddy or mommy, depending on the gender, of course. Because <laughs> we do have mommies too, and we have little boys. I can honestly say I'd say that the ex that contacted me has a bit of a little boy side. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> Uh, he showed that while we were together. But anyways, that's enough of that. I'm not gonna get into that because I just know it's gonna start something and I do not need drama. Yeah, you can see I have some... I kind of struggle with retaining little space. Well, not really struggle with it, it's just like... I'll go in and out of it sometimes. I guess it's kind of just like, I don't know how to stay in little space when I really need to. But I think daddy could help me with that like once we start, hopefully we start seeing each other. I really do want to meet him. But anyways, enough of that. 
Um, what else about being little is there? Um, some of us can go even younger. Like, some of us are even, like, two-year-olds, three-year-olds when we're little. Um, a lot of it can involve binkies or passies, um, if you're into that. Um, some people have the more kitty-like side, like I do. <laughs> I do sometimes retain a cat-like phase whenever I'm in my little space. <laughs> Which is why it's even more awesome that I have these. I have a bunch just dangling on them. <laughs> but yeah, um... Some people are always so into, like, retaining full baby-like um, aspects of it, um, like, being bottle fed, or having, some, some even have, like, these cuffs that have mittens on them so that you can't do anything with your hands, so that they have to do everything for you, which I don't, I'm not personally into, but that's interesting. It's definitely an interesting aspect of it. Um... Definitely not kink shaming, because why would I kink shame my old kink? <laughs> but yeah, I guess that's enough out of me since I'm already feeling like, I don't know, weird talking about it. I guess because I'm just not, I'm still learning about it myself, so I don't want to preach what I don't understand. So I'm kind of just telling you what all I do know about it and what stuff I've seen and what aspects I've noticed about it. So yeah, I will let you guys know more about it as I learn, of course. <laughs> but I think that's it for me, so I'm gonna go. So yeah, like this video, give it a big like, and of course comment whatever you might want to say to me, any questions or anything about my little side or about anything of the lifestyle, BDSM, or just anything about me in general. So yeah, bye guys.